Hi, it's Alex. Thanks for joining me. I am out and about around my favourite bit of canal in West Yorkshire. And it's good to see you all. I've come out because I finally went and got a new camera and I've come down here to just get off a couple of shots that I'm going to show on the rest of the video later on. As you can see it's really sunny and I am burning up in this. No, it's just your average January day and it's a bit bleak and there's not a lot of colour going on. But I've found a little scene with some silver birches in it in the distance and I'm going to take a couple of shots with my new camera then later on I will reveal just which camera I got. As you can see it's a bang average little scene by the motorway in the distance are some silver birches I'm just shooting this for the purpose of my I bought camera reveal video so anyway I'm done now I've shot what I've come to shoot a couple of images on my new camera and I'll see you back in the warmth so I've got a couple of new images out here by the canal and I will see you back in the warmth Hi there, it's a couple of days later I'm back at home, I'm inside where it's warm using a bit of side lighting I think it looks good um, I uploaded those pictures I took with my new camera look they're nothing stunning but I can see on them already that there's more colour, there's more detail and I think I've made a damn good purchase there um, did I go with my heart by going for a full frame camera or did I go with my head and sticking with the system I've already got which when I'm invested in um, the lenses already would have been the sensible choice so anyway how did I make my mind up well basically it was the miracle of Christmas and on Christmas morning I'm scrolling through my emails and I see a message from Jessups saying that this camera body is now 30% off even though it's X display and so even though it's X display I decided to go for it and I ordered it there and then and I don't think I'm going to be disappointed so the big reveal and here we are I've gone for the Lumix G9 already fitted up with its three-legged thing bracket an LE bracket it's got more megapixels um, it's got two card slots which means I can put in two SD cards and if one fails the other one will copy the images and I can still use them and it's also got a much better dynamic range and a much better bracket facility and it has an 80 megapixel high resolution function on it which I don't think I'll use too much because that'll just eat up my SD cards but you know overall I'm really happy that I've purchased this camera and I love it I love the Lumix range it's a bit more chunky camera but you know I can still hold it it feels really comfortable in my hand it's got nice dials on it um, the menu I know the menu anyway because I've already used the Lumix system and I'm really happy that I went for this camera it was a sensible choice to be honest you know I'm already invested in the lens system um, if my camera channel takes off and I can afford it later on I will probably invest in a mirrorless um, full frame camera but you know that's a long long way away and you know most of all I'm taking these pictures and videos for your enjoyment and that's what matters to me most I'm not bothered about fame or fortune 
I just want you guys to enjoy the videos that I'm putting up. So anyway, as I said, those images were not really that impressive, but they did display um, the cameras a better ability than my G80. And I think there is more detail, as I've said, and more color in it. And I'll put those images up now and you can have a look like so. nothing special I just wanted to get out there and take some pictures so this week I'm off for a trip up to the Lake District and hope to get some better pictures with my new camera do a little video and I will put that up next Sunday so thank you for joining me I feel honored that anybody watches my videos at all and I will see you next time. Peace. Mm -hmm.